Is it true that 93% of communication is nonverbal? It really doesn't matter what you say. What matters the most is how you say it. Probably you've heard this sentence before. Maybe you heard it at a communication training. When people say this, they usually refer to the so-called 7, 38, 55% rule, which says that 7% of the impact of our face-to-face -face communication comes from what we say, the words. 38% comes from voice volume, pitch, tone, and 55% comes from visual cues like facial expressions or gestures. This rule is based on research which was done more than 50 years ago by a professor named Albert Morabian, unfortunately. The findings of this research only apply to a very narrow set of circumstances. This rule is valid only when we talk about feelings, attitudes, likes, dislikes, and the messages that come from our words are in conflict with the messages that come from our tone of voice or body language. Let's see an example. Imagine you are in a heated argument with someone and in the middle of this argument, your partner says, stop. You need to apologize for what you just said. It was so rude. Maybe you don't feel like apologizing. So you do exactly what Joey did in this scene from the popular sitcom Friends. And I can even understand that you couldn't tell Rachel. But why couldn't you tell me? Huh? You had all day to and you didn't. I know, I should have. I'm sorry. <laughs> Do you believe his apology? Probably not. Because although he said, I'm sorry, how he said it sent a completely different message. So the Moravian rule is valid only when we talk about feelings, attitudes, and it doesn't hold up when we share facts. For example, you do a presentation at work, you share numbers, figures, then it's not going to be true that only 7% of the impact of the communication comes from your words. It's more than that. Still, it will be very important to pay attention to how you say it. It's important, but those numbers are not going to hold up. Thank you for watching this video. If you want more tips on effective communication, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you and see you next time.